Hey guys, I want to show you how to edit the style sheet sort of locally uh, using Firefox and Chrome very quickly. Um, okay, let's go to my desktop. Hopefully you can see what I'm doing here. So I launched Chrome, um, sorry, Firefox DevTools. So naturally, I don't know about you, but I usually like to launch Inspector and then change something here to uh, Red or something like that. Unfortunately, uh, in Firefox, uh, ooh, don't know what version I'm running, 39, doesn't work that way. The way to get it to work is to go to the style editor. Style editor. So uh, let me find the bit here. So this is the style editor, and let's just change it to blue or something. So great, that works. And what you can do is click save. Uh, let's put that in temp folder. And yeah, great. Um, if I refresh it, it will probably get lost. And then I have to basically just import it. And then it gets applied. And since it's cascading style sheets, the, the last one, the la technically the last one there should get applied if I understand it correctly. So that's how, that's how to uh, make it work in Firefox. Um, now let me show you how, well, actually, maybe let's make a further change. Let's edit in Vim and make that uh, green. Oops. I have to re-import it. It doesn't reflect immediately. Okay, so let's do the, let's just show you where Chrome is a little bit better. We can see with Chrome you can actually map the resource. Here we are in Chrome, and the way that's done is we go to uh, ooh, where are my sources? We go to the sources directory. Uh, ooh, ooh. Start from the beginning, and what you can do here is you ooh, I already have it mapped. Okay, let me start from the beginning. Let's get rid of this. So this is what it should look like. Don't know why I can't exclude this folder, but never mind. So what you can do once you've added, say, the temp folder is you uh, map it to a file system resource and you choose style here, which I will do. And then it'll ask you to restart. So now we have the style sheet of the one that we've just been editing. And you see the background is green here, but the background is not green here. So what gives? The caveat here, the caveat with Chrome is that you need to start editing the style sheet for the style sheet to have effect. That's very annoying, I know. So let's go for it. Let's go red. And now it is applied. And if I go control S, check this out. It's in there. Isn't that awesome? Okay, I think that quickly concludes um, how to do it in Firefox and Chrome. Chrome being a little bit weird because you have to, see if I go refresh here, it loses all the change. And then I just have to like press space bar, press, just give a space, just make a, just any change in style that CSS, and then it reflects that in the rendering. I hope that was useful for you guys, I, I really do. So thanks for watching and, and please like this video and then I'll, hopefully make some new new more ones